All right, item 6.4, uh, presentation of proclamation celebrating the retirement of Lakeport Police Chief Brad Rasmussen. And uh, Supervisor Green will be conducting this proclamation. No, he says no. <laughs> we'll get another shot tonight. Well, I think this is false advertising because you are retiring from Lakeport Police, but you will be uh, joining this board in January as an esteemed member of the Board of Supervisors. But let's start with the actual retirement part. And I want to do a shout out to City of Lakeport. You have two more paragraphs in your whereas's, so good job, City. Proclamation celebrating the retirement of Lakeport Police Chief Brad Rasmussen. Whereas Chief Brad Rasmussen has served with distinction for 35 years within the City of Lakeport Police Department, including 14 years as Chief of Police. And whereas he began his service in 1989 as a reserve officer and moved up through the ranks serving as a patrol officer, sergeant and lieutenant before assuming the role of Chief of Police in 2010. And whereas throughout his tenure, Chief Rasmussen recognized the importance of connecting public safety and community well-being by addressing homelessness and mental health issues, advocating for community-oriented policing, and supporting community events such as National Night Out. And whereas he was a leader within the Lake County Law Enforcement Chiefs Association by leading collaborations between local, state, and federal agencies to being critical to bring critical and timely training and key programs to enhance public safety in Lake County. And whereas Chief Rasmussen's dedication, leadership, integrity, and deep respect for his community will be missed shortly and is deeply appreciated. Now therefore, be it proclaimed that the Board of Supervisors of the County of Lake does hereby celebrate the retirement of Lakeport Police Chief Brad Rasmussen and sincerely thanks him for his service to not only the city of Lakeport, but also the county of Lake and wishes him much health and happiness for his retirement. Passed and adopted this 6th day of August, 2024 and signed by the chair. Thank you. Chief has to have some words. Let's do it, Chief. <clears throat> well, first of all, I'd like to thank the Board of Supervisors for recognizing my service uh, in law enforcement uh, in Lakeport and this county. Over the past three and a half decades, I've had the opportunity to work with uh, countless uh, county agencies, staff members, many, many board members over the years. And I've always enjoyed that partnership and always found that, you know, everybody that was out there, uh, regardless of what agency they were in, really cared about making a difference in our community. So I've always appreciated that. And uh, i also like to thank the public uh, for, for their support over the years. And I look forward to continuing public service and working with this board next year. Thank you. from the board I'll attempt <clears throat> chief thank you for your dedication to the community looking forward to working with you thank you so much thank you. yeah so we have been serving together on the disaster council for the last several years um, I hope you uh, take the next few months to rest up <laughs> and we really look forward to serving with you and having you up here on the dais with us thank you I'd just like to thank you for the long-term service, and I'm on the Disaster Council also, but I know the disasters we've gone through. I know that uh, you've done your part in the community. I just want to thank you for your long-term service. Yeah, and good luck on the board. Thank you. Chief, thank you for your service. Can't say it even more so than it's already been said, but uh, your service uh, is impeccable, and uh, I'm sure you'll do a great job when you're sitting up here with us next year, so looking forward to that. Uh, go ahead, Supervisor Green. I'll just brag on you a little bit more. It was a year and a half ago, we take down with me and said, this is not personal, but I'm going to run for And I took my word. Is this messing up? Thank you. How about that? That's better. Um, I have uh, 
come to know you better over the years in your various roles, not just the chief of police and um, a very capable leader and a thoughtful leader, just as the proclamation said, uh, driving leadership on uh, homelessness issues, understanding the interplay of mental health and policing, um, but also in this last year, I've, I've come to appreciate your, uh, as we'll state in the city proclamation tonight, your volunteerism with other community groups. Uh, it is a very hard thing to do to keep uh, momentum uh, in small communities, especially through volunteerism and uh, I, that stands out to me as much over this past year as anything else, not just the, a stellar law enforcement career and a very unusually thoughtful and compassionate approach to policing, um, but just how uh, fully ingrained you are in this community and why people do love and respect you so much. And I think that's uh, why they uh, spoke uh, uh, by legions in the election and, and voted to put you up on this day. So my personal appreciation to you, you've been a, a good police chief and also a good mentor to me. Thank you. Thank you. I uh, still want to let it open for the public if anyone wants to come up and say anything. Alan Fletcher, I, I want to thank you and your department for participating so vigorously in the Visioning Commission uh, forums. Uh, you not only came yourself to at least one of the public forums, but you sent, I believe, your new police chief, and he was there every single meeting. Uh, chief White from Clear Lake was there, and the sheriff was conspicuously absent. So one more example of public participation. On the forum, I, thought, I think we expected policing to be a number one hot issue, but in none of our forums did anybody stand up and complain about policing in the county or the towns. Thank you. All right. Sheriff Howe. Well, good morning, Board. Lake County Sheriff Rob Howe. I just want to congratulate Brad on his retirement as short-lived as it might be. Um, enjoy the next few months. I've had the, uh, the pleasure of working with Brad for our, most of our entire careers. I believe we started about the same time, different departments, same business. Got to work very closely together as partner agents of the Narcotic Task Force, enjoyed that a lot. I've always known Brad to be uh, an excellent cop, um, an excellent leader, an honest, strong family man. He's gonna do a great job at his next ventures. Congratulations, Brad. Good morning, Mireya Turner, Community Development Director. I have been super fortunate to know Chief Rasmussen for at least the last 10 years. And I echo uh, Supervisor Green's mentioning of how he serves as a mentor. You know, we've been through numerous disasters or emergencies, both community-wide and, and in my own personal little world. And, and throughout that, Chief Rasmussen is like oil on water, like nothing shocks him. And, and he's always about solving and working the problem and keeping people safe and benefiting this community, both in his professional as well as in his personal realm. And that level of calm and perspective and capability actually strengthens everybody that comes into contact with him. So very thankful. I'm not saying that just because you're going to be my new boss. So thank you. <laughs> Does anyone else want to come up and, uh, all right, there we go. I had not planned to come up and say anything, but Brad, I, I, just to you, from me to you, I mean, uh, we would have breakfast frequently uh, throughout the course of my time here uh, as the Lakeport Fire Chief, and you always was wise counsel. You always kept me from uh, making bonehead decisions, I think. I mean, I probably made several bonehead decisions, but I know you, you always helped me uh, with your guidance and leadership. But most importantly, I, I mean, your, your family and your children is a testament of who you are as a person, right? Uh, you know, I love what you've done with your, 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 your family and, and how your children have excelled. And uh, I look forward to um, uh, participating and, and supporting you in your new role as a supervisor. And uh, again, we'll continue with the breakfast. Uh, sir, what was your name? Jeff Thomas. Just for the record, just for the record, sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jeff Thomas. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. 
Kevin Ingram, city manager with the city of Lakeport. It was it was a real tough decision for us. You know, we've been had uh, Brad here for 35 years, and it was tough to let him go and and come over here to the county. Uh, but we figured we've been hogging him for 35 years, so it's only appropriate. To, no, I. Um, in all honesty, Brad, it's been it's been a huge honor. Um, I've had the the privilege to work directly with you day in and day out uh, these past 10 years that I've been with the city. Um, you're an incredible mentor. Um, you mean. A tremendous amount to us and we're, we're so excited that uh, you're not leaving us completely and that we'll get to continue to work with you in your new capacity uh, but thank you for your your visioning to the community you've been doing um, community policing as the the tenant of your your being uh, even before that name existed and uh, for that uh, the city is internally grateful to you if you want to hear me speak more on that issue in the council uh, we'll be honoring uh, chief Rasmussen this evening but thank you, Brad, for everything you've done for me personally and for the city of Lakeport. All right. If there's nothing else, we'll close it, bring it back to the board, and uh, we'll do our picture. Thank you.